Hey, what is up you guys welcome back to another video today we are watching the eminence in shadow season 2 episode 7 last time it was kind of a sad little episode where you know uh delta and alpha ended up finding out that john smith is indeed shadow or said and delta was like whatever she's kind of a you know a knucklehead so he sent her away on a mission so that she doesn't tell alpha and then alpha ended up finding out and she was very heartbroken because she felt that it was abandoning her and shadow garden and i thought that something like this might happen when he started acting like going against the girls but i don't know why he's doing it i say it all the time i don't i don't know why he's doing it because i mean i do know why he's doing it he doesn't know that all these girls they work and get all that money for him because he'll walk in and say it's mine and they'll give it to him so he just wants to bring them down and build them back up he's kind of sick but i mean it is what it is but you guys today i am excited if you guys enjoy consider leaving a like commenting if you're new here consider subscribing let me know what you guys thought about this episode down below and without further ado you guys let's get right on into actually wait we also got uh yukimi's backstory as well and how she was uh, engaged to get on so we know why she has beef with him but you guys without further ado let's go right on into episode seven Oh, the people doubting their currency. Oh, man. They really. Oh, man. Said, bro, you. Oh, poor Alpha, man. She's. I feel bad for her. Damn, the banks are closed. Wow. Damn. Wow, Oyukimi is watching, bro. I feel so bad for them. Oh. I feel like he thought she was dead. The Damn, okay, so he knew she was alive. See, I'm not mad at Yuki, man. I understand why she's doing this, but Shadow? Oh, wait, are we? Oh, is she about to show up like Kurama? Oh, she's lit. Aww. We're Alpha, bro. I feel so bad for her. No. Yeah, she's given up like completely, bro. I don't think he did, but you know, we feel that, bro, they did so much for him, bro. That's crazy. Wow. Still blaming themselves. Yo, wow, that's... Don't you know that they're just depressed? No, come on, no. Poor girl. I mean, she has to report. Too big, I don't care. But she knows it's not him. Hello. Yeah, I hate these girls. Yeah, this is huge. What does it say? Damn, there's light in her eyes. What does it say? Oh man, I've... I'm sorry, but I have decided to turn tree. Oh man, I hope. All this for us, bro. <laughs> That's sweet, though. I, I get it. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't think I'm wrong. Oh, quick. 
Oh. Okay, never mind. Maybe Shadow's cooking. Where's that Delta? <laughs> Yo, she hurt. She knows. Okay, that's Delta. Aww. Aww. <laughs> Delta's like, what the hell? Yo, <laughs> look at this guy. See, like, what? Do for my soul. <laughs> Yo, I hate this guy so much. Nah, I, I see the, I see it. I see the vision. He's cooking. And it smells good. I'm not gonna lie. Yo, damn. Yo, she's cooked. Yo, she cooked him. Oh. oh wow, he's popped he chose the red pill. Yukime. Wow, his eyes healed. Yo, you got the shotting on, bro. What the f Sid has to come save her. There it is. He punched it. <laughs> Let's go. Bro, gave, bro fed him a knuckle sandwich. He's like, yo, look what I was cooking. <laughs> yo, Sid is cooking. She's gonna think he's talking about her. Now he could keep the gold and Yukimi will think he's in love with her. I'm crying. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> Such a compassion. Wow, he's talking about the money. Rose is tossed and get turned around. Monge Kyo Shari. Oh! Oh! Bro couldn't even take his. He's gonna think he wants him to apologize to homegirl. I'm actually crying. <laughs> Yo, he actually has the sharing gun. I'm actually crying. Bro, it's the sun is rising. It was him. It was Sid that did that. Damn. Come join Shadow Garden, bro. Oh man. But you attacked her, bro. Damn, you can be in love with this guy, bro. He's like, oh my god. I do so much. Yeah, there it is. Aw. Oh, he's healing her. Oh, that's that's wholesome. I like that. Oh, he was the one that healed her back then to you. I hate said so much, but I like this connection, bro. She realized. Wow. They blame them and now Shadow Garden's lit too. Yo, he just threw him his ass in the Yo, I hate this guy so much. Yo, he just threw a little bit of snow on him, bro. What a sicko. I wonder what Getan's relationship is to Delta though. Huh? Maybe they're not even related. She's gonna recruit her. Oh, did she join? Yo, this guy's recruiting demons. Oh, 
Damn. How did they stack those up? Like those gold coins? Yeah, you see? Yo, she's in. Let's go. We got Yukima in Shadow Garden, though. Mm. Damn. Okay, Sid, I'm not gonna lie. Bro served a delicious meal. He cooked. Oh. Wow. Santa. An evil Finnish demon lord. Bro. The blood red. This is chase people's dreams. Wow. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, he thinks they're pissed off at him. The end of winter or something. I do not apologize. Bro, apologize. It is him. Wait, is she about to see Gethan? Boss is gone, bro. That's yours. So you guys, that was the Eminence and Shadow Season 2, Episode 7. Honestly, a banger episode. It was fun. We got rid of Gethan. Unfortunately, he ended up dying. But then we found out that even until the very end, he was in love with Yukime. And what he wanted to do was protect her. And apparently said when he was a kid. Well, not apparently. It did happen. When he was a kid, he beat Gethan and blinded, blinded him in one eye. And that's why he uh, seeked the power of the cult. To be able to become strong enough to protect Yukime. And then... Yukime was left in Shadow's Care, obviously, and now she's gonna join Shadow Garden. And for the last few episodes, I was thinking that it was like, you know, he was doing Shadow Garden dirty, but then this time, obviously, we found out that he was. At first, I thought that he was just joking and it was all a coincidence because it usually is, but he purposefully, like, made him, like, turned himself, like, went traitor so that he could corrupt both of them or, like, he could make both of them lose, like, value, like, both um, the Shadow Garden's company and Getan's company. And then he left the girls with like all the gold so that they could survive the credit collapse while Getan is the one that goes down and his that one guy got arrested too. So ultimately, uh, you know, said he's a good guy. I like that. And at the end, he left to go on a self-discovery journey because he thinks that like, you know, I'll find them are upset with him. I don't blame him for thinking that at all because realistically, you know, not everybody is like those girls like Shadow could breathe in their presence and they'll be happy. So you know he naturally thinks that they're upset and he wants to come back nonchalantly and this this and that but obviously we know that they're not upset with him and they're uh, actually very relieved that he didn't abandon them he doesn't see what we see behind the scenes how much like you know they care for him and even when he betrayed them they blamed it on themselves they said we're not good enough which uh, never do that people but yeah like you know it, it goes to show how much they value him but I'm glad you guys that things are working out. I'm happy. I'm happy for Alpha and them, Gamma and Beta. They were all happy. You know, we saw that those girls were the first ones there the, that Sid actually rescued and he taught them stuff. But it was really good. It was a wholesome episode. I liked it. It was fun. But you guys, if you guys enjoyed, consider leaving a like, commenting, and subscribing if you're new. Uh, you know, let me know what you guys thought about this episode down below. And as always, you guys, I will catch you guys in the next one.